Welcome to the BFI London Film Festival launch. You must be so excited to have your film entered into the festival. Very excited, yes. Yeah. Uh, it's pretty massive for us. Yeah, yeah, it's amazing. It's very, very exciting. And can you tell us about the film that you've got entered, please? Uh, it's called The Ghoul, and it's a um, psychological thriller um, uh, that twists and turns, and you're not, never quite sure where you are with it, um, in a good way, not in a confusing way. And uh, I, uh, <laughs> most of the time, um, I'm, I'm the lead in it, and I help produce it, and this is Gareth Tunley, who uh, directed it and wrote it as well. And, and so, but when you first submitted the film, what was the whole process for you, just to give advice to other people that want to enter their film into the uh, we ent we've entered quite a few uh, film festivals. Uh, I think we entered the the usual way. We've been screening the film, trying to get traction for the film, and uh, it was. Uh, I think we can safely say it was quite a surprise to uh, get the email saying that we'd been accepted. So I don't think I quite realised what a big deal it was until I sat in there and they went through the lineup, and I was like, oh. Oh, this is actually quite a big deal. Probably, probably, probably should start getting excited and terrified at this. So, uh, yeah, it's a good job. Yeah, we're, it's a, it's a great thing for us. And, and Tom, you were saying that you're the producer as well as an actor in the film. For, for other actors as well, trying to, to kind of get work, is it important to be able to produce and an act as well and be more involved in the production and take ownership of the story that you want to tell? Well, I, th I mean, for me, for this film, it was, it was an amazing opportunity to, to be the lead because I, I, you know, first to admit, I'm not very often <laughs> cast as leads. Um, uh, so uh, I will be now, of course, of course. Um, but I work very closely with Gareth uh, to, to help casting and things like that, casting myself. Um, uh, <laughs> very, very closely, very pressured. Very, I pressured him a lot. He's got scars. Um, but I mean, uh, yeah. It, this is something I've never really done before in terms of very serious role because I've mostly done comedy. So being uh, help, being involved in the production of it was really sort of important to me because I, you know, I got had a massive connection and worked very hard with with Gareth on getting th things right with the character. So a unique opportunity, I think, if, if for a, if other actors got the same sort of control, that would, it would be amazing. But I'm aware that it's quite a unique chance and opportunity. So. And, and, and Gull, can you tell us more about the story? What you know, what's going to bring audiences to come and see your film? Apart from you, of course, Tom. <laughs> Apart from Tom, um, we like as Tom was saying, it's quite a unique film. We hope it's a psychological thriller, but it's kind of got it's got it's a psychological thriller. We hope, which is very interested in psychology. Um, there are, without giving too much away, that two of the main characters are psychotherapists. Um, so it's very much getting it's very much using sort of elements of the thriller genre and little bits of elements of the horror genre to really get inside the uh, main character's head. Um, and I should say, like Tom gives a I think a amazing kind of very controlled, very nuanced performance. Tom's mostly known for quite big, bold, brash comedy, um, working with people like Noel Fielding and things like that. We've got in our for, for, for various reasons. We've got a, a cast of people who are kind of known for comedy. So people like Alice Lowe and Rufus Jones and um, Dan Skinner, who you might know from like Shooting Stars a few years ago, giving performances that audiences won't have seen them give before, giving very kind of pared down, very naturalistic, uh, quite intense performances in what's basically quite a dark film. Well, I would imagine then for you, because I remember Claire talking at the, at the launch of the festival about creativity being at the kind of heart of this. So for you to explore your creativity in a very different kind of way and, and a more dulled down way must have been exciting. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. I mean, this is kind of, this. And I, I mean, I'm risk of re repeating myself, but it's sort of, it, it's a unique thing. Um, uh, and I hope it's the start of a sort of different sort of branch of, branch and avenue of, of, of work and, and working. Um, I've loved working with Gareth on this and, it, and, and I think that it's um, a culmination, you know, film is obviously sort of a group, a massive group effort. You have to have a vision which Gareth supplied, um, but then a group effort to sort of make it happen and produce it. And then and then another level is, 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 is the production afterwards and getting it into places like this and the London Film Festival. That's a whole other push and to help hopefully make it bloom. So, you know, it's exciting times.